Hello, this is Steve, stevephoto.com, and I'm here today with another YouTube video uh, with another set of headphones to uh, show off. I searched YouTube, I searched the internet, there was not one review on the internet or one YouTube video at the time that I'm making this about this headphone. This is the brand new Harman Kardon uh, CL, which stands for classic headphone, over-the-ear headphone, uh, part of their beautiful sound series. Uh, they've came. They've come out with three new headsets for uh, iPod users because basically these are found in the Apple Store. Um, you have the CL, which is the classic, comes in at one ninety nine. You have the BT, which is the Bluetooth version of this headphone, which I believe they sell for two forty nine. And then they have an NC, which is a noise canceling, which comes in at two ninety nine. And if you look at the box, you can tell it kind of looks like the B and W P fives. So I was very intrigued by this, so I decided to grab a pair to see what they sound like because I was a fan of the P5s except for the comfort. Uh, the clamp pressure was so intense that after 30 minutes my, I got a headache using them. Um, and their sound was pretty balanced, soft, um, overall nice sound. But these, uh, Harman Kardon says that these are better than the P5s, so I wanted to find out. So let's open up the box, and since there's nothing on YouTube with these right now, I'll do a little unboxing. You take out the outer shell, and you have this gray box. We open up the gray box, and what we have is you have the headphones there, which I will remove. And here are the headsets themselves. There's no cable attached. Uh, instead, you plug in the external cable right here, and it comes with a cable. Um, these, this is plastic. It's not leather covered or anything like that. This is made out of plastic right here, or it feels like plastic. Um, plastic and metal construction. As far as feel and build quality, they feel a little more flimsier than the B&W P5s. They don't feel as solid. They seem a little more plasticky. Um, and the construction doesn't seem as nice and solid because when you pick up the B&W P5s they feel really solid and dense. These feel a little hollow feeling and light but that could be good because if they're light that means they could be very comfortable. I noticed this strap that goes on your head it stretches over this metal band for the ultimate in comfort supposedly so when you put this on your head this kind of stretches and it makes for kind of a custom fit. Um, these fold flat they do not fold any other way. Um, as you can see, the ear pads look much like the B&W P5s. So it kind of is similar to the P5s. Oh, it is magnetic. So it's just like the P5. Got a magnet. So there's the headphone itself. Let's see what else is in the box. You open up this flap here. And you have a case. This looks like a carrying case. And you have your manuals. And you have your cords or cord. The cord uh, has the talk feature so you can use the headset while talking on the phone. And it's basically a standard cable. And this little small end, the two and a half millimeter end. The two and a half millimeter end will plug right into the headphone base like so. And now you're all set to listen to the headphones. Let's see what the case is like. So this is a little strap. Looks like a, a sunglasses case almost. So it's kind of a pouch that you would just put the headset in like so. And a little elastic strap. And you are set. So the case is kind of large, but it's very thin. Um, in comparison to another case, in comparison to the Bose QC3 case, um, it's about the same. It's a little taller, it's a little thicker, or wider, and thickness is about the same. So it's not that compact because these do not fold up. So um, basically, what everybody wants to know about is the sound. How is the sound quality? How does it compare to something like the B&W P5s? Now remember, these are 199 the B&W P5s are $299. Uh, there's a new B&W P3 coming out that will be $199, so I'm guessing these are set to go against those. But in comparison to the P5s, I've worn these now for a little while, and I have to say that they are more comfortable than the P5s. 
they don't clamp on my head as much and it's more comfortable up here near the band. Um, they also, I will show you, it also comes with an alternate metal band. So if you have a larger head, you can take off the band that's included and put on the larger one. So for big head people, this is what's going to go on the headphones. Um, so Comfort, these beat out the B&W P5s. Um, they don't beat out something like the Bose QC3, which is a traveling headset anyway because of the noise canceling. These are not noise canceling. Sound quality wise, um, they're very, uh, they're not bassy, um, but they're not lean either. They're kind of balanced with a little bit of a sharp treble. So there's more high end I notice with these than low end. Um, a different character than the B&Ws, which are warm leaning headset uh, headphone. The B&Ws are a little more fat and rounded. These are a little more lean and crisp. I guess that's how you can describe it. Uh, these sound very good. There's plenty of detail. Uh, and the question is, are they worth $199? Well, if you like the style, if you like comfort um, and design, these are very cool looking. Uh, they're kind of unlike anything out there, the big square ear pads. Um, and you don't want to spend $300 on the B&Ws, which are very uncomfortable, on my head at least, because after a half hour they get really uh, tight on my head and my ears. So then, yeah, this would be worth it. Um, but there are some B&W P3s coming out any day now, and I hear those are also leaning on the warm side, um, and also here they're a little uncomfortable, So, but I have not used them yet. But for anybody looking to see what the Harman Kardon CLs are like, they're a very good headphone for $199. They're light. They're, uh, they're comfortable on your head. They don't clamp hard. And the sound character is overall very balanced um, and crisp and very detailed. So there you go. I hope you enjoyed this quick little overview of the Harman Kardon CL headphones. Uh, I think they're available at all Apple stores right now. $199. This is the CL, the classic version. Very lightweight, uh, very nice headset. There you go. Hope you enjoyed this quick look. Thank you. You didn't see me in Toronto when I first tried out some hash. Smoke through a pan and I do it again, but I didn't. Have